At the turn of the 20th century, Japan was still an agrarian society just beginning to industrialize. Most homes were without electricity, gas, and running water. Western countries, however, were pushing ahead with industrialization and had started mass production. World War I broke out in Europe in 1914, and this had great repercussions, even in faraway Japan. Exports increased, helping the Japanese economy to grow, but at the same time, imports declined, leading companies to turn to domestic equipment. Thus, Hitachi endeavored to develop original technologies and products to further accelerate Japan's industrial growth. Orders were starting to come in. However, the demand was difficult at first. Hitachi had little experience in assembling large pieces of equipment. What started in the engineering unit at the Kuhara Copper Mining Company, this marked the development that would soon become Hitachi. Everyone struggled very hard to build quality products and to meet customers' demands for quick delivery. For many products, the research, design, testing, and building only commenced after orders had been received. Sometimes, Hitachi's strong will to satisfy customers' needs led it to accepting orders with unreasonable deadlines. In many instances, requests could not be met and deadlines were missed. Namihei Odaida often had to deal with complaints himself. Equipment breakdown at Hitachi's Natsuigawa power station almost forced 42-year-old Odaida to step down. However, he remained honest and sincere with customers and did his best to meet their expectations. Odaida was determined to turn adversity into opportunity. Since he had long been concerned about Japan's failure to keep up with technological advances in the West, he committed all of Hitachi's resources to the development and production of large-scale equipment. A dedicated group was formed to test all newly developed products, and adjustments were made to eliminate any imperfections. Hitachi's mission became to contribute to society through the development of superior, original technology and products. In this spirit, workers joined together to improve the quality of products and prevent accidents. Assiduous efforts to win customers' trust resulted in remarkable growth over the first 10 years, enabling Hitachi to split from Kuhara Mining and become an independent corporation as Hitachi Limited.